everybody. Welcome back to Vlogmas. I am Cass Bowers and this is Cass Chats. Thank you so much for continuing to join me on this journey. Today I have on my earrings and my my um latest little, what do you call these? I call it a turban, but it's not really. This is like a scarf or a head wrap. That's what it is. It's a head wrap. These are actually a pair of pants that I don't wear anymore. They're like those loungy pants made out of um, um, like a rayon type spandex uh, material. So again, you know, I think I just, I love this head wrap life. So for today, as I, as I kind of alluded to yesterday, I thought I would do a kind of eyeglasses haul and my uh one of my other videos got copyrighted i was like copyright i think it was the one with the t-shirt that i had on that said i forgot what it said but it was a t-shirt that says stand with black women and so that's maybe why it got copyrighted but because i don't have very many viewers i mean it doesn't really i'm not gonna get monetized for any of these anyway maybe in the future but right now copyright is not that big of a deal it just means i don't get monetized and i do have to figure out why for sure, but even anyway, I still want to do this video and show you that there are basically only two eyeglass companies. I'm looking because my eyeglass, um, my eyeglass, <laughs> a little sneak peek, my eyeglass holder is right there. Uh, there's two eyeglass companies that I buy my eyeglasses from. It's a little tiny addiction. You know, uh, some people have said, you know, you only have two pair, you only have two eyes, so you need so many eyeglasses. But why do you need so many shoes? Why do you need so many clothes? You only have one body. Why do you need more clothes? It's an accessory for me. Anyway, these are the two that I love. First, there's this one, and then there's this one. These are where all my eyeglasses come have come from. And I have a friend, a good friend of mine, who you can't see the top of the head wrap. I don't know how to fix that. Let me move the camera back. There you go. Uh, I have a really good friend that kind of hooked me up last year on my birthday in 2019. On my birthday, she had these beautiful glasses on. I'm like, where did you get those glasses, honey? She told me. And after that, I went right after my birthday, got an eye exam, bought some expensive glasses. These right here were over $200, like $250. They are not transition, so they don't transition into sunglasses. So that would have cost more, but they are um, bifocal because I really don't even need glasses to read things in front of me. So I take them off to read, but I need them. I don't even need them to see the computer. My computer is like right there. I don't need them to see the computer, but I need them for driving. I need them for far distancing. So I was like, oh, let me get some um, bifocals, no line, no line bifocals. So then I don't have to keep taking them on and off. Like when I was still going to restaurants before this whole thing started, I would have to take my glasses off, read the menu, then put them back on to be able to have a conversation with my friends. Well, I was, well, why don't I just get some bifocals? And so I did, and I hate them. <laughs> I don't like them. I never use them. Um, they don't, they're not comfortable. They have these little, you see those, these little, um, little guards that I found out that I don't like. I don't, I don't like any of those guards. It just sits on my nose and it gives those little marks that aren't there because I don't wear these. These are my most expensive pair of glasses recently and I don't wear them. So let's get into it. I'm not going to tell you exactly where I got all the glasses from because I didn't feel like researching it. So I apologize about that. Um, hopefully I won't, um, I won't, um, get copyrighted again, but you know, so these are all of my glasses. So this holds 25. So you see, I have some room at the bottom. So that means I have a lot of glasses, right? So these are the glasses that I've been wearing for years. They're my absolute, they were my absolute favorite before I got addicted <laughs> to other glasses. And they are transition lenses, meaning that in the sunlight, they transition into sunglasses. So here are all my glasses. Yay. I wonder, do you want me to try them on? I can try on some of them. I don't know if you can see all of the glasses that I have. So first of all, 
on this little holder. It's normally in my bedroom, on my closet, behind my closet door. And you know, I have an accessories closet with all of my accessories, my scarves, it's all of my accessories, my earring. They're all in one closet and in the other closet I have my clothes. I know, I'm, I'm a little rougie. Uh, but my favorite glasses are absolutely these. I wear these practically every day. These are my absolute favorites. I think you might have saw me in these before, but they're my favorite. I love them, I love how big they are. I have big features and they go with my big features. These are my favorite glasses. They're black, they go with everything. Those are my favorite. Um, that's the number one favorite. The second favorite, I would say, the ones that I probably wear, um, I have so many glasses I can't see which ones they are. Let me pull it out so I can see. I love these. Also in a black kind of, um, and I love this kind of wide cat eye. Those are lovely. These are also transition. So the black ones I just showed you and these are also transition, meaning that they will turn into sunglasses inside in direct sunlight. Um, these are very cute and in a sunglass and they turn. Oh, love them. And then these are ones that it's a little bit different shape. Um, these are dirty every time I touch them. Now these, honey, a different shape and none of them go with my band. My head wrap for today but you know it's life these I love and if you could just not look not look at the headband head wrap I keep saying headband head wrap but these are a different shape I love these these I didn't get in a transition and I regret that because now um, I can wear them but you know as I said I mostly wear my glasses outside I don't need them in the house I literally never wear my glasses in the house it's just when I get to the back door and, uh, and I'm about to walk out I'm like oh let me go grab some glasses and you know I curtain them with my clothes of course but I never wear my glasses in the house well very rarely sometimes I do uh, and like when I'm in the kitchen filming these videos and I need to see far away I will grab a pair of glasses like you saw in my other video when I had on that pink body and I had on these blue glasses. Blue is my favorite color. And so these are transition and they transition and they're dirty. I love these little cloths though because they will clean them up really easily and I will be able to see so much better. Oh, yes. Oh, there's Kim. Say hi, Kim. Hi. Come in. There's Kimmy. Just came to say hi. Um, so these are actually transitions, so they will get darker in the sun. And I get my standard now because none of these glasses were over $50. So each pair of these, like these right here, I got these for like 10 bucks, And that's why I'm like... I put myself on the glasses diet and I, didn't, I said I wasn't going to buy any more. And then I saw these and they were like, I don't know, seven bucks or something like that. And I had to pay shipping and I only bought this pair. And I'm like, let me just get them without the transition. And I regret it. So from now on, I will always be transition. And same with these. I love these little cat eye little glasses. Isn't that cute? It just, it just gives you a different vibe every time you put on a different pair of glasses. And they are all dirty. I don't wear these often either. Uh, I feel like I don't really go to many places now because of the moment we're in, but also because it's winter time and it's Wisconsin. So I again ignore the the head wrap. But those are so the we went through kind of the top the top here. Uh, these are like my wider frame. My wider framed, uh, what do I want to call that? Like a cat shape. And these are the ones, brand new. My last pair for the year that I will be buying. You saw these before. Oh, yes. I, every time I put them on, 
with black and the pop of red. These are cute. Transition. They will transition. And the, the little shape right there. It's a good shape for me. I like it. The, the square ones are my favorite. You know, the blue. Favorite color. Had to get the blue. So my new thing is I will not buy any more eyeglasses unless they are a distinct different color. So no more black. No more brown. I have enough of those. These. These are the other ones. They're those cute. I didn't get these in transition either, but just think how great this would look as a sunglass. Like if this was a transition lens, this would be so cute. Let me show you the detail. That would be so cute. I really like, I really like the detail too. You really like the detail too? Mm -hmm. And my new ones that are blue and they're so hard to see. But yeah, look at really that. Hard to see. Look how cute that is. Yeah, these are I'm, blue. I'm, I'm probably going to be back. Okay. I don't know if you want me to be holding on that, but if it's going to be here, we're going to be here. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, Kim. So, yeah. These are super cute as well. Um, I mean, I'm going to say that a million times. But those are those. All right. These are another regretful pair. Regretful pair here. I'm cleaning them off get ready to see that the reason why I don't wear these is uh, they were again like seven bucks not expensive at all they're like real thin they're okay there's a yellow you can see <laughs> a yellow tint to it but these come off Ah, yeah, it comes off, but I never wear them. They're all prescription, by the way. These are all prescription glasses. I'm, I'm sure these are like under $7. I kind of have a rule. I don't pay more than $10 as the base price for any of these glasses. So if it's more than $10, I won't buy them. But, all right. These. <laughs> it's funny how I have a memory for every single pair of glasses that I own. These were the very first ones I bought in the kind of this inexpensive uh, glass shopping, online shopping that I do. And these were $1 plus like a $4. It was like $4 or $5 for shipping. So they're like $6, $7 total. And this is my very first. I'm like, let me try them. And I actually love them. I never wear them because they're kind of small. And I have a big, I have big features, big face and smile. And so they kind of get drowned on my face. So I never wear them, but they were one dollar, one buck. Um, I'm going to take a picture with those later. So I'm going to leave those out. Now, just drop a pair of glasses. These, oh, these are similar to the blue ones. They're actually almost exactly the same shape and size. And I have this, I have this pink jumpsuit with flowers on it. It has a pink duster. And I wore these for my birthday this year, 2020, October 2020. These were so cute. And they are transition and it was just adorable. Those are pink. These. Now these, <laughs> again, a story for every pair. These are so out of my comfort zone. And I bought them and I was like, I have this gold shirt with all these different colors in it. And it says black women are dope on this gold shirt that I have. And I'm like, these would be perfect. And I have white jeans that match the whole white shirt. And I need gold. I have gold, gold, some gold um, chucks. It was the look. It was a vibe. I'm like, I need the right eyewear. So I got these. Now, look at these. They are so big. And... They look so good with the whole outfit again. Not with this. <laughs> Ignore this. <laughs> but I was so surprised how much I liked them when I put them on. Because they're huge. How big those are. They're huge. But they're cute. They're super cute in gold. So I need to buy more gold. I need to go buy more gold. Other accessories, not, you know, whole outfits. I just got these and these were in my last vlog but I love them 
one of them. These are cute. The brown. Little specks of brown and gray. And that is it. I think I tried them all on almost. Um, which ones didn't I try on? I don't think I tried these. I don't wear these often either. These are probably the second pair that I bought. And, and the reason I don't wear them, I love them. Because I have that cat, that cat eye shape. I don't wear these because they're not transition either. So like I said, I wear most of my glasses outside. So that's why I don't. But look how cute they are. I love them. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wear them more. I dropped a pair. Not this pair. I um, am committed to wearing all of my glasses in 2021. And... That is all of them. So the bottom row, um, these are readers because as my, oh, these are um, actually these two right here are old prescriptions before before I started um, my online addiction. <laughs> so these are the older pair um, and then these two are readers. And so every now and then I'll throw a reader on to read because I need them, but mostly I don't wear them. And then I have room for six more pair of glasses. I have room for six more pair of glasses. This goes right there. And these go, these actually go right here. They're kind of not really color coded. They're more so by shape. And I literally, when I go, get ready to go somewhere, I just grab these. Nine times out of 10, I'm grabbing these. Unless I have on a specific outfit or color, then I'll grab the one that coordinates with that color mostly. I never ever wear these. I should actually move these down and move these up because I never wear these ever because they hurt. None of the other glasses have, oh, these ones do. These ones, I sound like Cam. Mostly all of my other glasses don't have the little um, guard. The thing is so painful. I think I'm just going to take it off if I can and maybe I'll like them then. And I don't watch TV anymore. Oops poke myself in the eye. I don't watch TV any, anymore, so that's probably the reason why I don't wear glasses in the house anymore because I don't watch TV. And I, you can't see my whole head. <laughs> because I don't watch TV, that's why I don't really wear glasses anymore at home. Because I would always wear my glasses to watch TV. And I literally had a pair of glasses just for TV watching that I kept in the bed with me so I wouldn't... Um, break my other glasses and so that was this these pair the one dollar pair were my tv watching glasses so after i finish my dissertation and i get back into watching tv if i do i will start wearing glasses in the house again other than that i wear them out to socialize and i will be doing that again very soon right because we'll all be doing that but again my favorite ones i love these the most so that is my kind of eyeglass haul it's been over time not really a haul so this probably took seven eight months to accumulate this many pair of glasses well except for the ones at the bottom because i've had those previous so yeah it's a little tiny bit of an addiction but i'm not buying any more this year i promised myself that there's only two weeks left in the year but i am going to be really a uh, better consumer and not buy glasses in the new year either one you're supposed to get your um eyes checked every year and so my eyesight could be changing and then all these glasses would go to waste so that's a reason not to buy that many glasses although i will probably i not not even probably i will definitely keep continuing to wear glasses that maybe are a little outdated in the prescription don't tell my eye doctor anyway today's video was a eyeglass haul i hope you enjoyed it thank you again so much for uh, coming along on this journey please like comment and subscribe and i will see you tomorrow thank you bye